just one of the ways that 23-year-old pastor Penwell Mguni blesses his followers at End Times Disciples Ministries in Sashanguve, north of Pretoria. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. He also dispenses blessings by commanding his followers to eat strange things, as Checkpoint saw firsthand on a visit to the church. This is that? Oh. Oh. But the God's power can turn anything to food. But it was the feeding of animals to his flock that attracted the attention of the authorities. These animals, God made them for us to eat. Amen. Although the pastor was arrested, police say they need proof that the snakes and other animals were alive when they became spiritual meals. In the absence of such evidence, the charges had to be withdrawn. After his run-in with the law, Pastor Mguni made sure to point out that the rat in his hand that Sunday was dead. <laughs> but a close-up shot revealed a different story. Is that? How does it taste? Perhaps the police should conduct a proper investigation. But what's in it for the congregation? A junior preacher at End Times Disciples Ministries claims eating strange things brings healing. You eat, you are delivered. You eat, you are healed. You receive your breakthrough. You receive your marriages by eating. So strange. The South African Council of Churches disagrees. There can be no salvation such as that. The lack of regulation governing churches is a huge concern, not only in South Africa, but also in countries such as the US, Swaziland and Nigeria, where preachers promise wealth, health and healing. Despite their concerns, the South African Council of Churches says people are free to worship where and who they like, however bizarre the rituals.